five-star pass rusher Shamar Stewart announced today that he is headed to Texas A&M, a school that he's been connected to for the past six months. Stay tuned. Whose world is this? The world is yours. The world is yours. It's mine, it's mine, it's mine. Whose world? Stewart, who 24-7 sports ranks as the number three defense alignment, the number 10 overall player, will become the first number one ranked player out of the state of Florida to sign with a school west of Mississippi in the modern recruiting era. Now, Stewart chose the Aggies over Miami and Georgia. His pledge ensures that the Aggies will sign the highest ranked recruiting class ever. Now, Stewart is a big believer of head coach Jimbo Fisher and everything he has done since arriving to College Station. And he thinks that this past season's upset over Alabama is only a sign of what's to come at Texas A&M. As he joins a recruiting class that already includes four other five stars and many other four stars. Now, Stewart told 24-7 Sports over the phone that he feels like they have the potential to be the best in the nation, especially in that front four. Now, Shamar Stewart's rise to a blue chip recruit it's kind of a crazy story. Now he's the son of a Jamaican immigrant and he made a name for himself in South Florida Youth Football League while in middle school. And once he graduated middle school, he headed off to high school where he played varsity as a freshman. Now, that's pretty tough to do. Most freshmen play freshmen or if you're pretty good, you might play JV. But Shamar played varsity as a freshman. And after that freshman year, he picked up his first offer from Pittsburgh. Now, after his freshman year, when summer came around, it was reported that Shamar had over a dozen Power 5 offers. But it wasn't until January of 2022 that the Aggies came calling along. But Stewart took his first official visit to LSU, where he thought he would call home once he went to college. But that visit didn't go as well as planned. So, once he got home, him and his parents hopped in the car and checked out the University of Miami because they're from Miami. And Stewart said that he instantly connected with everybody. He thought that Miami might have a chance to land his commitment. A trip out to Texas A&M a few weeks later, however, seemed to set the stage for the Aggies to eventually get Shamar Stewart's signature on National Signing Day. With Stewart now in the boat, Coach Jimbo Fisher and his staff can sit back and reflect on what they're getting in Shamar Stewart, the five-star defense alignment. The six foot six, 272 pound defense alignment missed most of his junior season because of an injury, but bounced back for a strong senior year. I mean, Shamar Stewart had 40 tackles for loss as a senior. Most high school student athletes don't get 40 tackles for loss in all four years of high school. He had 40 for loss in one season to go along with 14 sacks. So Shamar Stewart went full Aaron Donald in the high school level down in Miami where there's some strong competition. Now while he primarily rushed the edge in high school, his huge frame suggests that he might eventually get kicked in the inside in college. But the world will never know until next year. We saw a little glimpse of it in the Under Armour All-American game where he played some three technique. And he did pretty well. But there you have it. Texas A&M gets another five-star recruit. Comment below your thoughts on Shamar Stewart. Do you think this is the best five-star recruit they got? Because think about it, they got many others. Evan Stewart, Walter Nolan, their quarterback. That's just to name a few. But Shamar Stewart is the newest one. And I'm feeling like he might be the biggest one. Six foot six, 272 pounds, coming off the edge, having 40 tackles for loss in one season with 14 sacks is crazy. But comment below your thoughts on Stewart. And while you have it, leave a like for your boy. And like I always say, if you love college football recruiting or college football itself, go ahead and subscribe to the channel right now because it's free. But until next time, 